Welcome to this quick video on updating what's visible in the status bar in Microsoft Excel. So when you select any cells in Microsoft Excel, and I'm going to do that now, you'll see towards the bottom in that bottom bar towards the right hand side, you get a number of bits of information. Now yours might look a little bit different to mine because I've only got the count. So it's counting how many cells I've currently selected and the sum of all of those cells because it's got figures, it's got numbers in those cells. But it's not giving me any other information like maybe average or anything else. So there's a very quick way you can go in and you can add things you want to see and you can remove things if they are never relevant to what data you want and it's just muddling you and you just want to see the key bits of info. So whether you're on a Mac or a PC, you're just going to right click on that bottom bar and you can see there I've got a number of options on my drop down and I've got ticks next to a few of them. Now for the status bar section, I'm going to be looking here where it starts with average, count, numerical count, minimum, maximum and sum. So I've only got a tick next to count and sum and that's why only they are currently showing on my status bar. So if I click on average, you'll see average has now appeared. So I've got the average option. If I do another right click, I can add in any of the other ones as well. And if you click on one that has a tick, it will just remove it. So if you've added one, let's say I'm going to add the minimum in, it's 500. And now I'm just going to get rid of that because I don't need to know it. Then if you click on it again, it takes it off really, really nice and easy. So if I click on it again, you can just see there all the different options you've got to play around with. I would only add the ones that are relevant to what you might see, what quick snapshot of data you might want to be interested in so it doesn't clutter up the bottom of your screen too much and you can identify the ones that you're looking at. But a very, very quick video there just to highlight that status bar and the fact that you can right click and you can make changes to see different bits of quick data, quick information about the cells that you've selected in Microsoft Excel. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and let me know what videos you'd like me to record next.